guys, welcome back. This is Buildcraft Gaming and join me for another Crafters Corner playthrough. Today we're continuing the adventures of Grimjaw, the Hexblade Warlock once again. Now before we get started, if you're new to the channel, make sure to hit the subscribe button below and turn on the notifications as well to stay in the loop of all of my latest content. If you enjoyed the last episode and you'd like to see more of Grimjaw's past adventures, till this point, click the card icon to the right to access the playlist. And now on with the show. As you can see, we are in the middle of a orc stronghold. Orc? A orc? An orc. <laughs> Forgetting my English. A um, little bit of a debuff over here that I have on the right side. As you can see, I should be hungry. Um, I want to do this particular session with you um, because it's kind of important. See, we were here, Witchcliff secret entrance uh, that's where we were we finished off with the mirror and not sure what this place is but before we go on to our next quest which is i guess uh, well wh where, where is that ah over here in our time uh, i just kind of follow the map up the path and apparently i came to this place called dush nick yal it is an orc stronghold happened to stumble across them in the middle of the night camped a bit overnight over here uh, you know, everyone was kind of like in the longhouse behind me. So I didn't want to go knocking without any invitations. Uh, RP wise and just, you know, it's just not civil. But then again, this is an orc stronghold. Maybe civil is being a bit uncivil. Who knows, right? Um, a few things I wanted to do over here. Uh, number one, sort of do a little bit of a day trading sort of thing. Okay. Uh, as you can see, the loadout has changed once more. Um, I may, I guess, get some additional side quests here i suppose i don't know how this is going to pan out sell a few items buy a few items uh, most probably poisons and the reason why i said poisons is because um I was, and this kind of took me by surprise okay um i have a poison over here that says standard poison of ravage health now it doesn't seem to be that important on the surface but here's the thing a hexblade warlock does implement uh, a mechanic in which um, every hit does necrotic damage in D&D. What necrotic damage is, is an overall reduction of health, not just reduction of health within the health pool that a enemy has. So like if an enemy has 100 health, you then do some uh, necrotic damage, you know, or rather if you do some standard damage, it reduces the health pool within that 100, you know, that 100 limit boundary. Necrotic damage reduces the boundary, so it's not 100. If, if, let's say if I do a necrotic damage of, let's say, 10, it uh, the overall health is then reduced from 100 to 9, and it's non-reversible, right, in d and um, However, this is Skyrim. It's not D&D, obviously, and we can only Skyrimize to a certain extent. Ravage health poisons, which were part of, this, of the base game, um, achieves that effect for a certain period of time. And the... The beautiful part about this is Ravage Health Poisons stack. Now, here's the problem. Uh, the mod list I'm using utilizes um, Skyrim CACO. That is uh, a mod that revamps alchemy. And they've removed uh, Ravage Health Poisons, right? So the only way I see this is that I can only buy this from vendors. So I'm kind of trying to figure out if I can get um, ravage health poisons from vendors and have that as my standard coating and the reason I want to do that uh, is because I may want to take points in alchemy I didn't I didn't want to introduce I did not want to introduce alchemy in this build it wasn't the intention but um, I, I don't know it, it may once I start changing the enchants in my battle axe it may play a part and that too, you know, um, poisons only affect living targets so I'm still weighing the pros and cons of that Anyway, so uh, back to this, uh, right, we seem to have a bit of a choice over here. We have about 349 health, 394 uh, magicka, I think that's from the boost of the necromancer's amulet, and uh, we have uh, 344 stamina. Now, assuming necromancer's amulet, amulet gives me about uh, 50 extra magicka, uh, that means that it should be at a base of 344 magicka as well. So seeing as how we're in the later parts of, um, you know, the, the later parts of this build, 
uh, in the levels I'm probably gonna choose health all right uh, now at level 19 I got 359 I should be good uh, at some point in time I'll start removing all the excess uh, items uh, that don't stack okay so that that should amount to something but yeah let's see what we can do with one skill point over here but when i say amount to something i mean it should give us a more accurate number in terms of the health stamina and magical description levels uh, conservation destruction where can i put this one point uh, i am tempted to put this into enchanting uh, just because i want to take weapon enchanter so that I can enchant like um, absorb magicka uh, enchants on on my weapon when I do enchanting however I did talk about alchemy a little bit and the fact that we are also now using one-handed leads me to think that I should probably take one-handed mastery and maybe dual flurry right because um, I'm gonna use a lot of one-handed weapons from moving forward so uh, what about my heavy armor though heavy armor is at 69 i am one point away from the matching heavy set or one skill point away um i don't know block do i need block weapon block no can i take quick reflexes already no i can't take quick reflexes obviously the intention here is to go for quick reflexes at some point in time uh weapon block sounds nice but it is mod added and therefore not really that vanilla friendly all right um how, how vanilla friendly can you get when using a uh, mod like valkyrie not much of options so i'm just trying to make use of perks that sort of emulate um effects that can be achieved in the vanilla game so like perks with some alchemical effects equals to a perk in Valkyrie or a perk in the base game with some enchanting effects equals to a perk in Valkyrie that's the kind of uh, approach I'm trying to take so I'm not going to take any of those uh, extra mod added perks yeah so moving on to two-handed mastery do i want to take anything over here roiling charge this is okay war master i don't really think i would want to do that i mean having a paralysis effect is nice yeah but the inflicting to a uh, critical strike for two times critical damage that's just a bit op and forces me to use my uh two-handed uh, weapons more often the idea here is to stack the the weapons right so i have to use one handed and two handed let's just take a uh, quick look at what is that called uh enchanting not enchanting alchemy my alchemy is at 12 currently um and here's the reason why i said i wanted to take poisons yeah um alchemy mastery male factor all that's fine but i think there should be there should be one perk that allows me to hit uh, for an extra number of times, right? Uh, and it, probably concentrated poison, this one. All poisons you create now weigh less, and poisons applied to weapons last for twice as many hits, right? So I'm not sure what this means when it says twice as many hits. Like in the base game, I think it said twice. So like you could apply the same poison twice but a uh, poisons applied to weapons last for twice as many hits um kind of not sure what that means uh, could be the same thing all right or it it could be something that goes in i've read about this um there should be a perk over here that allows for the creation of uh, waxes and stuff like that if i'm not wrong just give me a sec. Uh, naturalist, benefactor, adrenaline, slow metabolism. This is um, stimulants. No. Maybe the mod list is curated in such a way that it removes the the ability to create waxes. And waxes are for those of you who don't know, waxes are sort of like this. Um, uh, what do you call this? Uh, they're kind of like oils in the witcher game where you apply it on on your weapon and it does an additional effect it's not an enchant it's an effect on top of an enchant right so in that game it made sense in this game i'm not sure 
but kudos to the guys who removed it um, I think they made the right call it, it probably wouldn't make much sense as well um, but yeah here's why I wanted to take um, alchemy because all poisons now uh, you know with, with that assuming that the ravage uh, poisons that I, I uh, coat my blade with last twice it means that given the earlier example I can reduce uh, a, a target's overall health by 70 in two hits. So I hit once, 35, I hit once again, 35, and because they stack, it's 35, 35, 70 overall reduction. This is a lot that, that just brings targets down within three to four hits. So um, I'm tempted to do that. Um, but like I mentioned, it only works against living targets. Also, the standard poison of Ravage Health is very, very limited, right? Um, so I'm just going to go check out and see if uh, the vendors over here carry some Ravage Health poisons. I'll probably stock up on them. And at some point in time, I'll probably take al Alchemy. But for now, I'm going to... Oh yeah, I haven't quite invested points yet. So um, Alchemy is 12. I'm not going to probably invest much in alchemy now. Um, what I'm probably going to do is I'll invest in one-handed. Alright, I'm still confused if I should do one-handed or... Um, you know, if I should do one-handed or if I should do uh, enchanting, right? And I'm, I'm very much inclined to do enchanting. Um, I'm probably going to... I don't know. I'm, I'm probably going to keep this point. And you know, just invest one point in one-handed and one point in an enchanting when I hit twenty, right? Um, yeah, I'm still in my early nineteens. Uh, you know what? What the hell? Let's just do one-handed first, okay? And then um, the idea here is to go into dual flurry without dual savagery. All right, that's just leaning in on. The one-handed damage. The idea here is to kind of counterbalance between two-handed and one-handed whenever we can, right? So there it is. Um, right now, where are all the NPCs? I do need to do some trading. Hopefully, they're around here somewhere. All right, there's there's this dude. I, one day I will shape a weapon fit for a chief. Maybe that chief will be me. Uh, kind of presumptuous, but okay. Are there any strongholds out there? There should be. Obviously, this can't be the only one. There are a few great strongholds worthy to talk about. Dushnik Yal, Morkas Gur, uh -huh. Nozzle Burr, mm -hmm. and Lagash Burr. Being there, that's how I got the stuff in my back. All right. Now, um. Fight well. Yeah, yeah, fighting well. Just want to quickly check. No one else is here. A little bit of running. Mm -hmm. Maybe they're all still. This, these orcs must be lazy. They haven't unlock. Okay, so it's locked then. Um, anyone up here? Nope. Nope. Okay. Well, seems like no one's there. Maybe there's a smithy. Wait, hang on. So he said craft. Maybe he's a smithy. Because if he's a smithy, then he can probably help me out with um, some crafting things that I need. I help in the mines as well as the forge. Nope, you don't sell stuff. Okay, right. Mm -hmm. He helps in the mines as well as the forge. Um, I miss that mod called knocking what is that called it allows me to knock see this one just gives me the ability to unlock i don't want to do that there's another mod that allowed me to knock and then depending on the disposition they could either answer or you know not answer i guess um quick check on the stuff they have over here nothing much nothing too game breaking i guess okay Probably I may not visit this stronghold again. Or even if I do visit the stronghold, it's going to be much later. Let's not waste time. Let's just uh, carry on. Now we're going to... 
Auto time. Let's resume our journey then. Yeah, shall we? Okay, probably this way. Oh, before that, gotta have a little bit of food. Uh, going with the same strategy, I'm just gonna go with uh, health region, stamina region, and magicka. A little bit of wine. That should put us in a good place. And now, we start running. Like, orcs are really, really strong creatures, right? They, uh, they have my mighty endurance, they have a damn good health pool, and they happen to be really fierce. Back here. Okay. So, this is where we were. What, what is this? I knew it. I knew it. Um... Probably asking for trouble. Yep, the current nearly pulls away. Stamina's back up. We should be good. Nope, nope, we're not good. We're not good. We're not good. Why? Alright, you know what? If that's how you want to do it. Fuck you now. Alright, 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 alright. You wanna play? Let's go. You tell me. Okay. Uh, let's see now. I need to summon. Uh oh, I am in so much trouble right now. Just give me one sec. Uh-uh. Uh -oh. Oh. What a time to run out of charges. Okay, I sh it's my bad. I should have... Um, yeah, I, I should have sort of made sure that I had enough charges. That's one soul sent to Sanguine. Lesser? Probably lesser. Okay. First you. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. No, 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 no. Die in my outfield? Okay. I've, it's been a long time since I ran like this, to be honest. Alright. And now I need to... What do I need to do? Now I need to top up my... Come on. Ready? Ready, soldier? I guess so. Okay. First point, first things first. Let's get, uh, why? Oh, okay, that's why. Hang on. Ah, ha, ha. See, Sanguine helped me. That's where the summon enemy comes out. Alright, come on. And, uh... Did you just... Okay. No? Maybe I should adopt a very summonary playstyle for this one. Not everything requires me going in and, you know, destroying stuff. Who the hell is boring? Why are you here? Come on. Okay. Alright. Okay. Okay. Let's uh... Hang on, let's feed first, shall we? Alright, you can reclaim what's rightfully yours later. Oh no, okay. Where's, where's my Daedric assistance? My Daedric assistance needs to be here somewhere. Okay. 
Nope, gonna need help. Gonna need help. Alright. Nope. You don't kill my... Okay. Come on. Come on. Come on. Not so tough for you now. See, I like to do this too. Too late. Okay, I'm gonna need my stamina. Oh no. Um, let's be smart about this. Why? No, I, I don't seek death. In fact, I employ your... Oh crap. Oh crap. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, quality potion of health. Not used in a long time. Come on. No, no, don't trample over me. Don't trample over me. Don't trample over me. Okay. Um, this is why you carry potions. This is always why you carry potions. Alright. War Mammoth. Damn, you're a big one. Okay. Well, uh, not interested in you. What are you? You are Velak the Vein. You're a kin valve. Alright. Alright, so the way it works is that every time um search nothing much over here actually except for force on gear. Yeah, so the way it works is that every time um Yeah. Uh, every time you level up I'm hungry. Uh the maybe today. The sang not every time. There's a there's a particular range in which uh, when when you level, the strength of the daedra that is summoned by the sanguine rose is different, right? So that technically makes the sanguine rose a much stronger option uh, for end game summoning, because when you summon the daedra at the end game, it just makes uh, you know the strength of the daedra is much much different mage glass great sword this actually looks good this looks good i want to carry it uh but my carry weight damn it why am i 900 though let me just yeah probably i'll just have to oh waning fire ring of help sure grip <gasps> sure grip wait hang on don't i have a iron gauntlet that do the same thing Alright, anyway. Enchant is enchant. Right? Can't, uh... Can't argue with that, actually. Feed. Favorite Namira. So as you can see, my favorite with Namira is growing with each corpse I feed on. You're the leader. I think I have already fed on you. I have fed on you as well. Okay. So a little bit of, uh... No, not not the best out of the box, but still. Yeah. Uh, let me. Additional full inventory. Love these mods that introduce additional full inventories. Um, just it just saves time, right? I. In in the base game, there used to be a lot of uh, going around, trading in between dungeons. With this, um, I used to use like convenient horses before. And convenient horses have this ability similar to what the followers have, which is unlimited inventory. Just absolutely unlimited inventory, right? And this is exactly what this is. And uh, yeah, it's a modded game. What can I say? I try to bring it to as close as vanilla as possible. But uh, of course, there's some things that are not going to be vanilla, right? So that's that. Iron Gauntlet's of Brutality. Power attack costs 6% less. Ah, okay. So that's the difference. Um, I would rather stack the scale gauntlets as opposed to the iron gauntlets. Um, but then again, I would also rather stack rings as opposed to gear. I need to see what I can do about that. Uh, necklace of bashing. Bashing deals. I don't need that. 
Arkish boots. I wonder if I have Arkish continents. Do I have Arkish continents? I may have Arkish continents. I may just need to revamp my entire gear, to be honest. Yeah. Skill braces are sure grip. Alright. Yeah, I'll probably do that offline, try to stack the continents and see if it works. And if it works, yay. If not, eh, whatever. Right? But why am I so... Oh, this is why I'm heavy. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. I did some cooking. And I just had to, like, unload all of the... Um, uh, what do you call this? Ingredients, you know? Because I just wanted to experiment. And, um, yeah, I forgot to put them back in the inventory. But, guys, for a character that doesn't delve into alchemy, it has a lot of ingredients. I just have this thing that I collect, right? So... It came from one of my other playthroughs. I'm probably when I'm done with this and I've updated the mod this, I'll probably try to initiate that sort of playthrough where I take this very uh, Witcher like approach. I, I keep saying Witcher, but to be honest, before the Witcher games, um, back really back when like in Morrowind and stuff, Skyrim, not Skyrim, but um, the Elder Scrolls already had implemented such a system where you could just poison weapons and stuff. So, uh, they were not the first. I can tell you that much. They were not the first. But, you know, um, it's, it's, it's a mechanic that is as old as time, right? So, it's, there's only that much that can be said. Okay, I think I've got Let's go. most of my gear sorted out. Let's just get the charges done because sometimes it gets really really problematic <laughs> all right that's that vampire greatsword is good volundran is good this is good okay cool now onwards with our journey oh more corpses can i eat you ah let me feed on you okay well for some gear i'll have to trade that at some point in time let me eat you yes yum 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 33.3% That's good Yeah Okay King gel deck You know what I'm just gonna take the dagger as well It's minimal weight Uh Solomon You are now Yum 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 I'm eating you Right Not too much Can I feed on you? Nope I can't feed on you See this is like dead weight What am I gonna do with all this like really, what what am I gonna do with all this? It doesn't make sense. So I'm not gonna take that. Um, okay. Oh yeah, there's the mace and the stuff. Shit, I do need to. The mace is okay. Thorn of Ikor. Probably petty. Lesser. Common. <laughs> petty. Lesser. <laughs> Enchanting is. This is taking a lot of en um, charges, by the way. 50% chance, regardless of charge. And you know what? I'm, I'm gonna stop charging you. I'm gonna save it for my Daedric uh, stuff. Oh, so that's why. Alright. Joining the action. Where you at? No? Yeah, all over indeed. Okay. Harvest body. Oh, yum, 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 yum. You guys don't mind if I just chew down on this, do you? Alright. Uh, so yeah. Thanks for the help. Not many willing to take on the Force War these days. You don't mention it? Alright then. I'm gonna have Kinneret. Okay. All good stuff. So satchel, more ingredients. All right, more ingredients, more stuff. All right. I did not really want to do this, but hey, who am I to say no to free stuff, right? It just happens to be there when I'm passing through. If it happens, it happens. Mandrake, I have no idea what Mandrake root is. Uh, see, this, this is the kind of thing, right? So playing Skyrim for this long, I sort of come to understand oh no why who fuck that's a lot yes yes you knew it and now here i am 
All right. And come on. Okay. You're mine. Whoop. What? Stop. Yeah, okay. You know what? I do need. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Okay, okay, you can play that game. Shit, 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 shit. Okay, I do need my help. Wh what do you mean death cannot save me now? Don't run away. Oh boy. I'm probably gonna need my stamina, aren't I? Whoa, no! No, 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 no. Okay, I need help. I need help. I need help. Make up your mind. Already lost. Yeah. Have I? Someone there. Okay. Oh. Come on. Come on. Need assistance? Yes, the challenger is there. Come on. Don't don't die yet. Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. Time to finish this, indeed. Nope. Do you? Really? You say that? You keep annoying me. There we go. Now you yield. See? There's a huge difference between yielding and not yielding. All right, come on. Where's the rest? Where's the rest? That's for annoying me. All right. Better search. So I saw, I saw one of the enemies actually having sort of like an absorb magicka enchant, and I just hope that. I can get that weapon because that would save me that's like the missing piece is that you that's you isn't it oh i'm running after you where are you where am i She's testing me. I need my stamina, I guess, and stable elixir of regeneration, I guess. Oh fuck! There's a dragon now. Of course, there's a dragon. Um, hang on. Where's my Where's my other stuff? Where's my other stuff? Okay. Hang on, I know there's like a staff of flame at Tronakia somewhere. There we go. Oh. Alright, sure, 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 sure. Okay, dragon fight. Unintentional dragon fight. I gotta probably okay well the soul trap thing is not really working too much so what I will do is I'll map number six to the flame atronox stuff as opposed to uh, soul trap that would make sense for you know kind of switching in between Come on, dragon. I lost my target, but you know what? I'm gonna get a dragon soul, right? Where are you? And then she's taunting me. Fucking hell. Wait, did she summon the dragon? 
Didn't she do that? No, why? Screw you, my crap. Alright. Oh, you know what? Screw the dragon. I'm gonna chase after the, the one that I can see. No, you won't. And just like that, you're dead. Bandit Cloaker. What does that even mean? Now, oh, mine. Frenzy. Uh, shock. Beef. Alright, cool. Wow, she's really making me work for that. Okay. Okay, at this point in time, um, let's see now. I need to consider my options really carefully, right? Let's, uh, let's try to get uh, invigoration. Stamina regenerates, reduces poison damage. Uh, vigor is 50 40 seconds let's do vigor okay my stamina regeneration takes a hit because of the necromancer's amulet but i think i should be good did i lose her okay well i'm probably gonna head back to the dragon anyway yeah let's head back to the dragon if it's still there I can still kill it. If not, I'll just go back and loot the corpses and I should be done. We can proceed on. Come on. There we go. Hey, dragon. And go. Again? Hmm. I, I hate being caught in this sort of loop where the dragon doesn't turn up and stuff. It just annoys the hell out of me. Alright. Uh, okay, there we go. Come on. Uh, boy. Right now, I gotta go chase the dragon. Okay. Screw this, I'm going back. Oh, wait, hang on, there's a horsey. Should I get the horsey? Maybe I should get the horsey. Let me just go get... Um the stuff off the corpses first. Who? Oh, this is the Alakir warriors. All right, all right, all right. Cool. This ends now. Does it? Does it though? Here they are. Okay. Today. Patrol Archer. Alright, I'm I'm sure I'll come across them at some point in time. Okay. 
and now it decides to show itself. Alright. Wait for it. And go. Crap, 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 crap. What? Nah, <laughs> chicken. Chicken, I, okay. Okay, soul captured. Not too bad. Where are you? No? Okay, time to do a little bit of... Um, what is it called? I had that mechanic figured out the last time. Um, let's see now, I conjure familiar. Oh crap! Are you dead? It's dead. Nice. Okay. Dragon Soul Absorption time. Come on. Make me look epic. <laughs> yeah. Dude, go, get out. This is my landmark. Get out of here. Go. Yeah. Dragon soul absorbed. That's pretty nice. Okay. Steel. Uh, yeah. I can carry this way. Let's go. Okay. On the plus side. I managed to slay a dragon, I get a dragon soul. Cool. And Ah, uh, she's just being annoying, isn't she? Why? You know what? Go go chase after her. Please go chase after her. She's right there. Go chase after her. Oh, am I supposed to take, take the horsey that was there and chase after her? I think I'm supposed to take the horsey, aren't I? Alright, I sound like a five-year-old horsey. Alright, you know what? I'm sorry, Mirai. Not sure if you're alive. And quite frankly, I don't really care. I need your horse. That is right, I do need your horse. Now, where are you? Something tells me that she's straight down. She might be straight down. Hang on, is that where I want to hit? Uh, our time is that way. I could go through White Run. Rorik's dead. Is that what I want to do? Where the hell am I, though? Uh, where's my current location? Okay. Uh, fine, I guess. May not necessarily need to go that way. You know what? If she wants to come back, she wants me to chase her. That's fine, but unless she's explicitly within my sights, it's not gonna happen. In the meantime... <coughs> I'll just take advantage of the horse that I have. Yeah. It does a fine job as it is. I saw a corpse there. 
Okay. No mind. You know what? Distractions, distractions. What is this? Am I supposed to be here? Mm, probably not. Turning back. Unnecessary combat. This is why this is why I wanted to do explorations in the morning, right? Because it makes it so much easier to see. If it was in the night, I'd probably just have stumbled in that area, fought all those force on, and for no particular reason whatsoever. Looks like uh, that lady was right. Got to chase her. There we go. Come on. Exit. Nope, I found you. A is where, where is she? Isn't she here somewhere? God, she's good at disappearing and stuff. Yeah, no bear. No, no. I'm not gonna kill it today. Uh, I'm here, so I'm going through Sun God Pass. Honestly, I'd rather go through there. Broken Tower Redoubt. Karth Wasten. Oh, that's Karth Wasten. Okay. Trying to parry it. Yeah, so I was near Cartway. No, that, hang on, Cartway since the town. I'm taking the long route, aren't I? Ah, uh, damn it! Damn it! Maybe I should just cut across. Probably I can cut across. Okay. Damn it! She's there. Just egging me on. Where is she? Did I kill her? Did she evade me again? Ah, oh, what the hell, man? What the hell? Well, I'm obviously not gonna. And why do I have this weird effect on me? Okay, this, this is blood, and that means she's got to be here somewhere, right? No? Oh. Damn it, I almost had her. Okay. What are you looking at? What, what are you looking at? Is there a dead body here? Please tell me this. Ah, oh, there's a dead body here. Yes, I got her. I got her. And now I kind of need to target her. And it's not happening. Come on. Damn it. Like, I know. Okay, so that's the dead body. 
Hang on. Summer. Damn it. She's got loot, loot that I want. Oh, that's annoying. That is annoying. <coughs> Gore. Hmm? Uh, I need you to do something for me, okay? I'm gonna... I'm gonna try this. What do you need? I'm gonna try friend? this. If it works, it works. If it doesn't, what it do doesn't. What do you need? <coughs> um... Come on. Nope. Is that it? Ah, uh, that is annoying. Oh wait, hang on. Ah, <laughs> got you, got you. All right, what do you have? Damn, it was worth it. Look at the mana loot she has. Illusion, windling flames, major wielding, one-handed. All right, so I got one-handed and two-handed now. Major magicka, and this is the main price. This is what I was going for. Nordic Sword of Harrowing. This is what I need, to be honest. And with that, I just invest a point in... Um, if I level up, I probably invest a point in enchanting. I can start enchanting my uh, battle axe with a different enchant. And all these empty soul gems. Yeah, you know what? Just enough talking, enough said. There we go. Okay, cool. All right, now with that, I should be able to take away most of my gear. Who's this? It happened so fast. One minute the dragon was there, the next it was gone. Ah, uh, yeah. Everything was destroyed. No, mm -hmm. I, I, I killed the dragon. I don't have to ask you. I know I killed the dragon. Now, where's, where's my horse? Or rather, where's the horse that I stole? Damn it. I got the loot and I lost the horse. But it was worth it. It was so worth it. Okay. Now, where do I need to go again? I need to make my way there. Which means I need to head over in this direction, I guess. Is that it? Yep. In this direction, over here. Traveling the wildlands, cutting across. Oh, I know this is probably going to be a little bit of a long episode, but trust me guys, it's going to be worth it. Because once we get to Orthheim, it's 5.58, so trying to get that by nightfall. Once we get to Orthheim, I get that task done. I should be in a position to start... Alright, what, what is this? Uh, more stuff. Okay. Go, my minion. Take care of him. Heavy armor increase 71. Okay. Just casually walking up. Alright, there we go. Okay, I'm wondering if I can do this and then... Nope, use this to restart my stamina. How do you go down in one hit though? Alright, go. Give me some. Sorry. Alright, alright. Don't be a weakling. Come on, get up. There we go. Alright. Now, it should work with um, that other spell, right? I have it saved. Conjure Familiar. Alright. If I use my map purely to just um, go across, casting Conjure Familiar and hitting it a few times should be able to give me... A sustainable amount of stamina back. Alright. Let's test it. Doing that. 
Oh crap, wrong one. Shit. Alright, um not working out as uh, right, there we go. Okay. It's gonna take a bit of getting used to. Okay. Okay. Alright. There we go. Not so bad. There's more? Okay. Oh no. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna get my stamina back from this dude over here just like that. Alright, there we go. Wait, why? Why are there so much? Okay, 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 what's going on? Yeah, of course I win. Okay, let's have this thing out. Okay. And obviously, I'm not gonna waste time collecting their stuff, but okay. Man, this is getting a bit repetitive. Uh, in terms of the pattern, but there's no other choice. I gotta make it there before nightfall. Oh, yeah! seriously? Sorry, Gore. Interesting actually. Hey, Saber Kitty. Alright, done. This is. What is this again? Lunch. Okay. Okay. Of all the things to trouble us, who's Lund? And where am I? Lund's hut? Rorikstead. Okay, so I'm in Rorikstead then. Um, fine, it's not too far. And it's night as it is. Sorry guys, looks like I couldn't make it by... Um, you know, by, by the evening, but hey, at least it's it's not completely pitch dark yet. So, hopefully I can make it over there. Slay a few of them bandits, and we should be good. Oh, oh no. Yeah! He's full no, of... Okay. <laughs> Give me my stamina back. Yeah! My stamina. And you thought I was just a pretty face. You're nothing. Be careful. Okay, 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 okay. Stop running. Skyrim belongs to the north. Nope, it belongs to me, asshole. Uh -huh. 
There we go. Anyone else? Anyone else? Uh, okay. Yeah, he didn't seem to need my help. Alright. Let's uh, call our little familiar friend out again. Oh, now now I'm suffering a debuff. Damn it. Okay. Right. Um. I want to make sure that we get at least to to that place before we call off. Like I know it's kind of late, and you know, it's, it's uh, the video's gone on for quite some time. But what the destination is what it counts, right? Hopefully we don't get interrupted anymore. Alright. God, I love that mechanic. That's like an on-demand health and... Probably even, you know, health, uh, not health, stamina, and probably even magicka potion. Like, I don't need potions, I can just do that. And that'd be more than enough. I'm gonna quit my summon, though. I mean, like, my summon wouldn't get much mileage out of that, you know what I mean? Okay, we, we should be near the place, I guess. Insufficient level to capture a soul. flower it's good it's going good crab a shanty the place that I want to go to seems to be very very dark am I supposed to go up seems like I'm supposed to go up isn't it okay my crap actually this is the perfect opportunity to there we go. Capturing souls. Ah, uh, yep, yep, I knew it. Okay. I'm supposed to go up. And it makes it really difficult because I can't see. Um, maybe I should just head back. Who? What? Yes. I've been hunting and fishing in these parts for years. Why did you call me? You said help. What can I do for you? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. I'm just I'm just a guy who's lost is trying to find his way, alright? Damn it. Fighting styles often come down to build. All right, here we go again. Got arms like a clan fear. You got no range with a weapon. With a shield. Oh, this increases my two-handed as well, which is a very nice added side benefit if you come to think about it. Okay.
No, not gonna do that again. He's gonna keep walking. Oh boy, it's almost painful. I say almost because I want to make sure this thing works, and that I don't. At least I, you know, at, at the very least, I leave you guys with, um, you know, with with probably some some form of entrance. A right, little bit of agility work over here. Oh, here we are. That was relatively easier than I thought it would be. Am I tired? Am I tired? I'm tired. Okay. Whoa! Can I get a break? Nope. Okay. Okay, guys. So, as promised, we are here. Um, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna probably step in. Another one? Wow. Ninja doesn't have it easy, does he? There we go. So, uh, guys, see what I'm, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna save here. I'm gonna do a. Let, let me. You know what? Let me. Let me get my health up first with the same method that we discovered. Uh, where's this? Okay, there we are. Th there's an enemy. What? What's he doing, dude? Okay, at least this one's a bit easier. Okay. Um, give me a sec, guys. Oh, that's clairvoyance. Conjure familiar. All right. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna call it Daedric. I don't know, in WoW there was this there was this mechanic called demonic pact where you could sacrifice a minion for either mana or health back. Probably I'm gonna call this Daedric Pact or Pact of the Familiar. Right? And all that's gonna be is just a resource gain. So mana at the cost of or rather um health and magicka and stamina restoration at the cost of a summon and you know probably soul gems so yeah let's do this let's save over here mandatory save okay we're gonna do that and uh let's step in okay uh, if it's gonna be a very long dungeon i'm probably gonna you know just kill a few enemies and save if not if it's a short dungeon then we we'll probably just go ahead and finish it hopefully it works hopefully it's a uh, it's it's not too long. And right off the bat, okay. Someone is here. And uh, what do we have? What else? Do we have? Whoa! What what's going on? Where? This is called being smart, not weak. Okay. See, they're doing it again. They say they heal, but they don't. Wasted. Wasted. Uh oh, uh oh. Got that right. Alright. Can I? No, you don't. 
Okay, got him. Who else? What else? Please don't kill me. I haven't even begun to kill you. There we go. Now you're dead. Now I've killed you. Oh, he said, please don't kill me. Damn it. Uh, who am I supposed to? You know what? I... Okay, now, what am I supposed to do? Pull the chain, search the chest. Dwarven Maze of Wilting prevents stamina and magical regeneration. That sounds good. That sounds really good. I'm not sure if that's a standard, uh, what you might call it. Is, ooh, feed. I'm not sure if that's what you might call a standard enchant, but, um, yeah. Okay. Who is this? Whoa, okay, no, 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 not going back. Bandits. There seems to be a lot of... So it's a what very short dungeon. Thing in the world. It's a superbly what short dungeon. Most of them are silver hand, sword obviously. Sword this is the silver hand quest too. line. Silver hand leader. Yeah, I'll feed on you and I'll just do a quick search on your corpse, all right? Quite sure you're gonna have something exquisite for me. No. All right. Well, um, guys, here's what I'm gonna do. All right. So thanks for sticking around so far. Uh, I'll end the episode here. It's been long enough trying to get over here with the multiple uh, events that happen along the way. But I hope you guys had fun as you joined me along this journey. I'll see you guys in the next episode, right? So till then, take care, stay safe, and uh, don't forget to hit that subscribe and click the bell notification icon thing. I suck at this. You guys probably know this. So yeah, um, anyway, ciao guys. I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye.